we've romanticized amateurism somehow, and I don't see any coaches signing up to be amateurs. If it's so great, let the coaches sign up to be amateurs and let them continue their studies and get an additional degree or something while they're coaching. And we c the system is corrupt. No one believes in it. No one believes in it. Not the coaches, not the athletes, not the administrators. It has to be destroyed. That, that's the only solution. And when we talk about paying a kid with an education, I, I got one of those educations and I was prepared to take advantage of the currency that Ball State University was willing to pay me. Too many of these kids aren't prepared to take advantage of the education they're being offered. Right. It would be the, if they paid me in size 32 jeans, I couldn't use them. Right. And that's what we're offering kids, stuff they're not interested in and aren't prepared to take advantage of. Let's take the money that the football and basketball players are generating, and instead of funneling that money to the welfare sports, the, the sports that generate no money, Funnel that money into developing these kids before they ever get on your campus so they are prepared to take advantage of the education. Funnel that money to incentivize them to pursue education while they're on campus. Give them some type of financial bonus upon graduation or something. But, but to sit here and, and come up with the reasons why we can't change the system is a joke.